Hi, I'm Sharon Francis. Welcome to Chances, etiquette for everyone and any occasion. Today we have a bonus series. As you know, I teach corporate and university classes. And with the summer coming right around the corner, I've been asked to give my top 10 tips for being a successful intern. So let's get counting. One, do your homework. Read the company's annual report. An annual report contains information about the company's activities throughout the preceding year. Search for articles published about the company in both conservative and liberal newspapers. Two, know the corporate culture and dress the part. If you're in a creative environment, the dress attire may be casual, but you still need to look professional. If you're in a more corporate environment, the attire may be formal. If the employees wear suits and dress conservatively, you should do the same. There's some great articles online about how to work with people from various generations. I talk a lot about this in my classes, as I really do believe it is a key to getting ahead when working in a company. Four, get to work early and leave late, and be on time for all your meetings throughout the day. Be engaged and volunteer to help on projects that highlight your skill set, and be available and a team player. Five, don't miss out on an opportunity. If someone offers to take you to a meeting, go. Which brings me back to tip number two, dress appropriately. I've seen many interns miss great opportunities because they were dressed inappropriately or didn't volunteer to go to a meeting. Six, refrain from drinking at office parties. Parties in the office or drinks with coworkers are still considered a business environment. If you get drunk, people will remember and talk about your unprofessionalism. Seven, Remember coworkers are not your friends. No matter how friendly the environment, it's still a work environment. Refrain from sharing too much of your personal business and watch your activity on social media. Eight, communication is key. When emailing, remember to be formal in nature. You are working in an office, not emailing a friend. Refrain from using slang, emojis, smiley faces, and LOL. Answer your phone in a professional manner and refrain from using slang and cursing when speaking at work. Nine, when your internship is over, write thank you notes. Write thank you notes to everyone who ever helped you in your office. They'll remember. 10, keep in touch. Keep in touch with both your employer and fellow interns. Your fellow interns will be your colleagues in the future. Remember that internships can lead to jobs and recommendations, so put your best foot forward and good luck. Welcome to Chances, etiquette for everyone and any occasion.